Here's a GRE algebra question. Let's take a look. If g of 3x is equal to 3 times g of x for all real values of x, and g of 7 is equal to 4, what is the value of g of 63? A lot going on here. And sometimes on quant questions, it's helpful to start at the very end and work our way back to the beginning. And I'm going to give us a little hint to get started. I'm going to rewrite g of 63 as g of 3 times 21. I have not changed a thing here, have I? Right? 63 is 3 times 21. So I'm just rewriting this in a longer way. g of 3 times 21. But look at this, and now look at this, right? We know that g of 3 times x is the same thing as 3 times g of x. So if I were to match this function notation here with this, right, the x would be 21. And this means that I can rewrite this as 3 times g of 21. Take a minute to look at these two right here and, and make sure you understand how that's the same thing. Everyone with me? All right. Well, now we can just do it again. Check this out. Three, uh, three times g of 21 is the same thing as 3 times g of 3 times 7. Again, I just broke this up. I see this multiple of 3 right here. Well, I can, as I did before, move the 3 right outside. And that's 9 times g of 7. And now we get to this part. What is g of 7? Well, g of 7 is 4. I don't know what the actual function looks like, but I don't need to. Because I know that g of 7 is equal to 4. And 9 times 4, 9 times g of 7, is 36. For more GRE tips and tricks, or to sign up for my online course, follow the link on my profile.